Hey guys, coming back to you with another video today. I have some goodies that came in. So I am sorry that I haven't posted in a while. Life has been going on. Let's just say that. Okay. All right. So this is kind of fun for me because I have some um, unicorns, if you will. These are some things that I have wanted for a long time. And um, the person that I work with at Louis, I don't work at Louis Vuitton, but there's a uh, SA or CA um, that I work with. She is fantabulous, but she was able to source all of these different things for me. Well, it's a lot to me, but yeah, so she was able to source these. I have them now, so this is great. So the first, this is not a real unboxing, but I'm gonna leave them in a little pouch. So the first one that I'm going to share with you is the key pouch, but the key pouch has this cute little um, design on it. And I do have a key pouch in the monogram print, but I have wanted this for years and either, you know, life, something happened, you know, where it's just the money was not available for me to go and buy all of these little things that I wanted. So I have got my, one of my unicorns here, the key pouch. Um, let me unzip. Inside we have the tags. Well, I'm sorry, this is, I call it a key pouch. It's a key clay. So, but inside it's this pretty, like, I guess, watermelon pink color. It's fantastic, fantastic. So zipper is wonderful. You can even, you know, put the keys inside. I use this for, um, you know, dollars. Sometimes I put coins inside, but what I mostly use it for is I'm running into the store real quick. I throw my driver's license, my debit card that I'm going to be using for that day. And that's what I put in. That's what I put in there. So it's cute. Shay cuteness. Okay. All right. So we have that one and her little box. So we're going to put that to the side. This one I got uh, the other day, and this is the multi pochette, right? But again, I'm another unicorn because it has this nice print. I believe she said it was Japan. Um, so it has the, the chain. It has the Louis Vuitton made in Paris. And in that like watermelon pink, they're both the same color. And inside are the tags. And then that same nice uh, watermelon pink inside as well. So absolutely gorgeous. I have watched a lot of videos to, you know, what's in my, what's in my bag, what's in my multi pochette. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to carry in this baby right now, but I'm just real excited, happy and blessed to, to, um, to have it right in my collection. So there she goes. And I got rid of her box, so I don't have it. Um, okay, so I'm going to put her to the side. My next one that came in, this is something that I've wanted for a long time. Um, all of these have the print on it. And again, I'm sorry, I don't know what the print name to this one is, but it also matches um, what's on my uh, key clay. So yay, matchy, matchy. Um, but I would have taken it in any print that they had. So, okay. All right. So this guy is the passport holder. Again, all rocking that watermelon pink kind of color. Um, this is uh, Louis Vuitton made in Paris. And we have the card slots here. So like if you have global entry, or just any other documents or something that you want to put here. Um, you could also probably put some, uh, you know, dollars, you know, currency for wherever you're traveling to. I go to um, Mexico uh, from time to time uh, to visit my daughter. Well, I have to go more often if she's going to watch this. She is going to watch this and tell me you don't come enough. But anyway, that's something else. But um, you know, you can just stick your passport in. I'm not going to put mine in right now, but yes, I have wanted this for a long time in the monogram canvas with the print. Love it. And it goes all the way around the back. So 
Let's open her up there. It's such a cute little design. Um, it's, it's just fun, right? I didn't want the regular monogram. I was holding out for this guy. So, all right. So that's my passport holder. And I have the um, PM agenda. Um, and I used to use that for my uh, passport, but uh, as my passport holder, but um, I decided to use something. I wanted something uh, different. So, and this is the box that it came in. Okay, and the major unicorn for me, and I, there's two others um, that I want to get. I don't plan on using this at all. I know you can say that that's a little crazy because of the cost of this guy. So this is not a true unboxing, but literally I got it a, like 20 minutes ago, courtesy of UPS and my wonderful sales advisor, uh, client advisor, whatever you want to call it, because I've heard it called a couple of different ways, but she is fabulous. She is just, she is the bomb. Okay. All right. So my Clements notebook, and it's got a fun little print. It's like a winter print. That's the whole design. It is, I love it. I really do. I love it. I'm so stoked, right? Grown woman up here, just all excited over a little notebook, right? So it doesn't have the watermelon pink, but it does have a regular uh, pink, uh, very light pink inside. It also has a string, like a notebook marker, if you will. And at the bottom of the pages, it says uh, Louis Vuitton. Okay. Now, some of the notebooks have like a Louis Vuitton uh, embossed uh, inside. This one does not, um, but that's okay. I'm holding it upside down, but yeah, it's okay. I'm good to go with it. Um, again, this costs a lot. <laughs> so, well, to me, it costs a lot. This book as of today, let me see where my little price tag, the receipts are somewhere in there. Um, this was about, I want to say, three eighty-five, um, perhaps somewhere between three ten and three eighty-five for this notebook. Uh, if I got the wrong price, I apologize. I'll uh, when I post the video, I'll put the right price uh, inside. But um, some people, you know, when I looked on the YouTube videos, other uh, YouTubers, they, you know, some people use them to. Um, journal in etc this for me is really just a collector's piece it, it really is i wanted it um in my collection um so i won't be using it um at all i may put my name in it but i will not um be using it um at all so okay all right so lastly what i will show you let's turn this the other way so okay so Lastly, what I will show you is I requested some perfume um, samples. I um, have allergies, so I can't take anything really, really strong. So, and I haven't sampled these yet, but this first sample is City of Stars. I'll try to get close so you can see the name of it. City of Stars. Um, these are all unisex, um, but I was told a lot of people gravitate to this one. Um, I don't like anything super florally. Um, if it's the most I can do with like the flowers is like the a light gardenia lavender kind of smell. Um, so yeah. And then this one is imagination. Okay. And then this one is afternoon swim. I believe I've smelt this one before, but we were talking me and my essay or CA. Um, I'm just going to call her my essay. Um, we were talking about my allergies, but I really wanted a nice light scent to wear. Um, I usually, right now, I, um, I'm wearing um, Burberry Her, which is a light scent. So, um, but I wanted something different. Okay, well, this is it for me. This is what I wanted to share with you guys today. Definitely, thank you so much for watching this video with me. Um, if you've got any comments, any questions, um, I can go back and do a wear and tear later on, but I'm happy to give you any feedback that you would like. So 
I'm going to go and I'm going to go and play with my um, my new little unicorns that came in. Yay. So one more time for the road before I go, because I'm just so excited, right? Some things have got to excite you. Some people are shoe lovers. I'm a lover of LV and some other brands, right? Um, I do like YSL. Um, I can't afford Hermes. I, I can't, but they have some beautiful, beautiful stuff. So, um, but there's a lot of other brands I like as well. But my eye right now is on the YSL Lulu debating the medium um, or the large, but I want to have a speedy 35 in my collection, which is LV. So I don't know. But anyway, last uh, chance to take a look at, you know, my little unicorn. So my Clements notebook. Key clay with the pretty watermelon pink. Yay, fun. I pro I will have keys on this. I, I keep a lot of keys, but I definitely will have keys on this. Okay. Passport holder. Again, that pretty watermelon pink inside. And the beauty of all beauties, the multi pochette. watermelon pink inside again and again I think this is uh Japan is what she said but if you think it's something different you know let me know but that's what she said she thought it was uh the Japan uh print okay guys it's Wednesday for me so wanted to tell you guys to have the best most productive most blessed remainder of the week that you can have and um, do something positive. Be positive to somebody else, even if you're gloomy. And if you're gloomy, turn that smile, I mean, that frown to a smile. On that note, see you later. Bye.